Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Happy New Year. I hope everyone had a really good holiday with friends and family. Just gonna have a little chit chat with my hot water. This might sound weird to people, but I love drinking hot water. It just kind of warms the soul. Grew up in an Asian household drinking hot water. My dad normally drinks tea, but my mom and I drink hot water a lot. Let's get chit chatting. Just gonna chit chat about resetting life, a life reset in the new year. So last year, I spent a lot of time figuring out my life, my future, and I lost sight of what's important. I realized when we're 70 or 80 years old, we're not gonna look back and think about how much money we made or our career success. We're gonna be reminiscing the memories we made with our family and friends. I know I'll be looking back and reminiscing the times that I spent with my family and friends and how many fun memories I made with them. I'm 26 and I already cherish the moments in my childhood and my teenage years having movie nights, birthday celebrations, road trips. I should really stop focusing too much on reaching my financial goals or my career goals and really cherish the moments with people I love in my life. I've been a little anxious and worried about where my YouTube channel is going and I think I got a little too caught up in it where I would keep looking at the views and I'm like, how many views did I get? Or how many subscribers did I get? But I get so caught up in it that I feel like it's whenever I post something, it really takes over my day and I feel like I can't relax and just kind of be okay if I don't get a lot of views or if I'm not growing as much as I wanted to. So yeah, last year has just been a roller coaster with switching jobs, going from my 9 to 5 to freelancing to ultimately starting a YouTube channel and going through with it. I give up a lot and I don't really go through with a lot of my ideas because it's scary it's scary putting all that time and effort in and you may end up nowhere and you have to start from scratch again even with all my anxiety and worries i think this year will be different because let me tell you why it's gonna be different because i know when i'm older yes i'll be looking back on how much time i spent with my family and friends and the memories we've made but I'll also be looking back on how I lived as a Christian. It's kind of scary talking about religion on camera and posting it on YouTube. But to be honest, I think my mindset shifted and it's slowly shifting towards a more healthier outlook on my path in life and not control trying to control it too much because ultimately we don't know what our future holds. I was searching on YouTube for inspiration for my next video. I'm like, hmm, maybe I should search up Esther Sim. I came across her most recent video called A Fresh Start and I recommend watching it. It's very well edited and it's very insightful so go and watch it. What really pulled me in was at the end. She said she had a word for the year to focus on and that word was faith. It made me realize how much I was chasing success rather than chasing God. I knew it inside that I was chasing all these materialistic things, but it never really clicked until I heard her say that word at the end of her video, and it was helpful that another YouTuber said it. So this year, I'll be refocusing on my faith and remembering what my purpose is. Just want to say thank you, Esther Sim. <laughs> uh, it will be hard, but it'll be worth it in the end where I'm not so caught up with my materialistic goals in life. Yeah. Please let me know what your New Year's resolution is or if you can relate to this as well. I would love to hear from you guys. 
chit chat is done. <laughs> and speaking of life reset, I'm gonna clean up my room. I have not cleaned it since like November or December. Everything was just so busy during the holidays and now it's really time to reset. <laughs> Let me show you guys my room. It's really messy. Just like random slippers and workout stuff. I really need to organize this. I feel like it's overflowing with all my lipsticks and hair clips and hair ties. This needs a little bit of tidying up. So I have some things I have to return here in my bags, a pair of socks. And this desk needs a lot of tidying up. And there's my little quote to remind myself to get my stuff together. And then I have this little pile here, my snowboarding butt pad. These are all clean, by the way. This is not laundry. This is just a basket that holds my snowboarding stuff and blankets. So I'm gonna start cleaning now and you guys can tag along with my cleaning process. We took Callie out to a new cafe and it was such a cute cafe. They allowed Callie to come in and she was just chilling on the couch while we were drinking coffee. And now we're going to take her on a little stroll uh, along the lake. And the view here today is so amazing. I've never seen the clouds like this. It's it looks like there's mountains, but it's just clouds and there's like a whole... You'll see. Let me show you guys. Hi. <laughs> We're going snowboarding and we came early, but our pass doesn't work till four and we didn't know. So we have an hour and a half to kill until we hit the hills. I mean, until we hit the slopes. We're just gonna take a nap, then we'll start snowboarding at four.
just got back home it was super super cold out but now we're gonna eat our ramen and watch netflix we're gonna finish kaleidoscope kaleidoscope is really cool let me know what order you got because we got yellow first and then green and then we're gonna watch the third episode One. We're gonna play It Takes Two. It's a really cute video game. I suck at video games, but this is gonna be fun. This is our team. Oh, oh this is like a mini game. Come on, try to rock me. Oh, I almost got you. To double jump, so XX squared, remember? So XX squared. Squared makes you dash. So look towards my direction. Oh, this is so hard. Wait, bro, no, I'm going nowhere. Bro. Okay, now look towards left. Okay, you want to run and then go XX squared. XX squared. Nice. Okay. Ah! Ah! <laughs>